Okay. This is uh, a video on me replacing my transmission on my old washing machine. I got this from Genuine uh, Parts and uh, that's the part number 35-6615. Uh, I was watching the appliance guy and decided I wanted to keep my washing machine because it has uh, levels of water <coughs> that you can set being high. In other words, the tank fills up each and every time. Uh, I opened the box and cut it. There's the uh, transmission. There appears to be a uh, gasket or something of some sort. Uh, let's see, I think that this is the upper end and it came with this box with pieces in it and that's part of the reason I'm doing this too. It came with a seal hub kit. So this was $350 delivered, $54, but it was a uh, three hundred and fourteen for a new transmission and a uh, kit and that's why I came here to open it up and I just wanted to catch there's a sealed tube and a W number for the kit uh, I wanted to see exactly what I had and what I'm going to be uh, contending with I still got to find a spanner wrench and another type of wrench that to the appliance guy had on there to remove the uh, the seal but I'm gonna see if I can come up with another answer all right this is what came in the uh, the box sealed tub kit it came with uh, a rubber ring of some sort the gasket that I had to take off according to his instructions I'm certain it's a one-time use Another one, which I don't know if I see that, I'll let you know where I saw it. A, uh, a, a kit seal with a bearing, I gotta figure out where that goes. Along with uh, an assortment of uh, bolts. And I noticed this one was different from what the appliance man had in his. And this appears to be one piece with, uh, with uh, the uh, threads here to remove and so they look like uh, they screw on this way and out the correct way counterclockwise so I'm gonna grab a spanner wrench and try, try and remove mine but what it also says here is this note and it says the washer has been updated with a high torque transmission and requires a seal kit if repair hub and seal kit is needed order kit number two one zero zero eighteen sixty eight so I'm gonna look that up too but I'm gonna go compare mine right now to uh, that assembly so let me go look keep my light to get some light on the situation okay yes indeed mine looks to already be that so I should be able to get away with a spanner wrench and by the way this light here it's a great one the TLR-1 HL it uh, stream light it's for my pistol but I use it everywhere because it's just frankly outstanding so let me get the spanner wrench and uh, remove that going counterclockwise okay I opened the kit uh, of screws to take a look and see if what I believe is right is right. I'm trying to still get this off having a hard time and this also appears to be here with a bearing on the lower side that's mounted and the tub is in a wafer and mounted so I'm going to remove four screws and pull the tub so I can see what's going on. <laughs> 